This video starts with, um, well, let me just say, if a company gives you good service, I'm all for giving them good praise. If it's not so good, hmm, we, um, we have big plans for this room, which will all be unfolded in this video, I'm sure. Um, you've obviously seen me decorate it, but uh, last weekend, we nip down to your wonderful Swedish people, those guys, an amazing service. We all did it online, drove down there, picked it up, absolutely seamless, brilliant. But we ordered the rest of the stuff for this room from Wayfair, who promised it would be delivered on Tuesday, which then quickly became Thursday. Which, after talking to them today, turned out, mm, we'll try and do it for next week. My response was, that's not good enough. Cancelling the order. So, quite a big order, quite a lot of money, was lost by Wayfair. Which is a shame because it's not Wayfair that loses the money. It's the supplier to Wayfair that loses the money. But, on a positive note, it means these guys have got more of their business and more of our custom and tomorrow stuff will be delivered but this today will be built so you're going to follow me well you may not you may switch off at this point but hey if you stay with us you can follow me <laughs> right let's waffle off and get on with it and we all love a good unboxing don't we So, let's do one. <laughs> it's going well, isn't it? Ta-da! And there we have it. Um, flat pack furniture. You're going to love it. But this is going to be the start of what this bedroom is going to become. Right, let's get it out. Can you tell what it is yet? Oh, instructions. I'm an idiot nose, I'm a man. Doopy doo, we love flat pack furniture. We love screwing things into flat pack furniture. We love using the cheap tacky tools supplied with flat pack furniture. <laughs> Mr. R, what are you doing? Oh, you caught me. I told the punters I weren't using the instructions. Uh oh. I lied a bit. Oh, did you? <laughs> You don't normally use the instructions, you usually completely ignore them. Um, yeah, there's a couple of twiddly bits. Oh, that I see. I to know about. All right. I not get it wrong. Wow. Wow. Well. So, what are you building? Cheap flat pack furniture. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think it is? Well, I think it might be my dressing table. Oh. A dressing table. Mm. Oh, I see. Yeah. Have you told everybody what happened with the wardrobes? I have mentioned that, uh, yes, Wayfair couldn't run a drunken night in the brewery. But there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Put it politely. Yeah. Yeah. Um, not impressed. But um, no. Yeah. Three so, times they delayed the delivery, didn't they? They did. Mm. I told the punters all about it. Third time, cancelled. Yeah, we don't mess about too much. No. If, uh, if we get good service, yeah, we, uh, we're all for giving people a good shout out. If we get lousy service, then they get roasted. Absolutely. And unfortunately, Wayfair uh, are a lousy service, which is a shame because the company that bought Wayfair buy it from are going to miss out. Yeah, but that's, that's not, not fair. Problem. No, it's not their problem. No, it's Wayfair's fault. So. However. Ikea to the rescue and should be delivered tomorrow. Yes. Yes, all the rest of the bits that nobody knows anything about at the moment, but maybe, well, many people may have guessed what it is, but yeah. I haven't let the cat out of the bag yet. Oh, right. Okie dokie then. We'll say no more, shall we? We'll say no more. Say no more and we'll leave you to it. I'm going back to Wimbledon. Bye. 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 <laughs> and there you have it, ladies and gentlemen.
we have a dressing table. Part of the start of the bedroom makeover. A uh, little drawer in the front. It's obviously, look at that, it's obviously got to be bolted to the wall yet. There is also a glass top to go on it, which is down there. Uh, don't want to put that on until it's in its final location because you've got to put brackets and everything in the wall and to hold the glass on as well. So uh, got to be in the right place. But um, yeah, the rest of the stuff should come tomorrow from Ikea. Again, save the day. And uh, yeah, in probably this video, you may even see the finished results of this room. Who knows? Isn't it exciting? Anyway, I'll do it for now. Catch you in a bit. The next day. Well, we had the delivery. Ikea came up trumps. Much better service than before. Um, yeah, <laughs> I've got a lot of work to do because there's two boxes there, big box there, which is very heavy. Uh, another two in there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, another one there. And a very untidy house around it. Right. This is going to be a long, hard day. And before we do anything, how about a nice rainstorm and a bit of thunder? Lovely. Yeah, that's a scope of my plans. <laughs> I was doing other things before I get started on the wardrobe. Ah. Yeah, I wonder why. Right, let's open it up and see what uh, what can make out of this. Yeah, I'm guessing the two big heavy boxes, which is one of them, will be the main components. We shall see. Well, that's one unboxed. I think you can get the idea of what's going on now, if you haven't already, which you probably had. Hmm. A lot of work. Now it's coming down. Look at that. Oh, yeah. July. You inspecting Dad's work, Ted? You supervising? No. Just came to see and it looks boring, so I'm off. So? So? After shenanigans with Bum Company not bringing wardrobes, mm. the next morning we have wardrobes from Ikea. Well done, Ikea. Mm. Brilliant. They did good. They did do good. Well, they did good when we went to pick up the dressing table, didn't they? There was no cues or anything from click and collect. No, straight in, please. straight out. Easy. Oh, you come back, Ted, to make sure of you. Um, there are instructions, though. I know they've got the universal, but... Um, yeah. Yeah, sometimes they're a bit... You have to scratch your head a little. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's clear when you kind of... Look at it two or three times. What do you do? When you understand what they're asking, yeah. yeah. You just gotta look at it two or three times. Yeah. Alright, well we'll come back in a bit. Ah. Bye. Bye. Ted. Bye. Or he's going to find Nathan. So we're getting there. Now what tool that IKEA provide? I want to just show you this because it's pretty good. So look at this. Took me a second to figure it out, but let me show you. So I'll get you back in camera in a sec. You put your nail on there, like that. And then when you hit it with a hammer, uh, which I can't do because I've got two hands now. <laughs> I've got full. Hold on. You have to do, there you go. So it's tacked in. So it basically guides you to exactly the right place where you need to be. So then when you drop your tool away, you just give it a little tap like that. Didn't tap it in far enough, Reeves. Or something, yeah. God dear. There you go. So, yeah, it lines up your nail. See, so don't make a mess of it. Yeah, it's just a little bit of plastic, but <laughs> works really well. A great idea. Well, one down. There you have it. One carcass, not much else. Um, some doors down there, some doors back there. 
So I've got another one of those to build, then we've got a central part, and um, yeah, then we can start working out what I've got to cut off the skirting board, <laughs> what I've got to take off where, um, what I've got to move. I'm wondering whether that plug's going to have to go, to be honest, because um, this is going to be flush. Oh dear, yeah, it's got to be done right though, it's got to be done right. All right, crack on, stop waffling, boy. Wow, you're getting on. Yep, second one together. Not too bad actually, it's took me what? Half hour, to be honest. Yeah. They're quite easy. Um, yeah. Basically you've got, got these locking pins. So you've got pegs that you screw into this. Locking pins, lock them together. Obviously dowels as well you've got to, to hold all this together and all this in place, but yeah, it's pretty easy. The longest bit, to be honest, is putting the backboard on because you've got to put all the nails in. But, um, yeah. With your little gadget. Yeah. I've got two now. <laughs> They're great. Right. They're just such a genius idea. Yeah, you just put the screw in there and screw it, nail in there and hammer it. Brilliant. Clever. Very clever. All oh, right. So there's one standing behind you mm -hmm. with a bar in ready to hand close. Mm -hmm. And one that's just going to be put upright, is that right? Yeah, but obviously then there's the other bit that goes in the middle, however that fits, I don't know. Um, there isn't a bit in the middle. Well, whatever. That's it, just two one metre wardrobes. That's the other bits, must be doors, yeah. Yeah, two they're doors. doors. Two mirror doors and two plain doors. Oh. Yeah. And two doors there. Okay, that makes sense. Right, yeah. Two, yeah, that's fine. Okay, okay, right. We'll come back in a bit then. Mm. I've got to start chopping skirting boards to bits. Yeah. More mess. <laughs> See you soon. Bye. There you go. Almost there. Well, not almost, but the carcasses are built. Um, all I've got to do now is start um, <laughs> ripping things to bits. I use skirting boards, which have got to come off. Um, I've also uh, Got to take some off this one as well, so they go flat against the wall, which is the plan. Um, what I may do in time as well, well, one thing I am going to do for definite is there's going to be some shelves down this side that I've got to build. Um, and then it'll sort of look as if it's the whole length of the wall. Um, and maybe in time, what I will do as well is make some sort of overhead for it. I've got an idea of um, boxing it in from the ceiling down and then maybe stepping it out slightly, put some down lighters on it. But at the moment, just got to get them fitted. That's the main task. Oh, but we are getting there. Uh, wasn't too bad of a job at all, to be honest. Instructions, pretty good. Um, yeah, just got to bolt them to the wall so they don't fall over. And uh, yeah, obviously just uh, <laughs> get them look like they're fitted. Right, stop waffling Reeves, this ain't getting the job done. Well, it's, um, <laughs> it's all heaven again, but we are there, all bolted together, and bolted to the wall. There you go. Two in each of them. Job done. All the skirting boards have been cut down, they're pushed against the wall, nice and solidly fitted. Not much of a gap down that side. The walls are never straight in these houses, so you can't expect it to be. But a little bit of silicon on that, you'll never know. Uh, once the door's on, I don't think you'll know anyway. But um, yeah, there we go. The carcasses are where they're supposed to be. Last bit, the doors. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I've got a whisper because the wife's literally just come back. I'm going to surprise her. Hold on. Hello. I've had to stop. Oh, I've had to stop. Hi. Got a major problem. What's that then? You better come and have a look. I've rushed home because I'm missing Alcaraz. Alcatraz? <laughs> yeah, Alcatraz. Oh. What's the problem then? Well, you better go and have a look what's happened. Gonna have to move the doors because that's not how I want them. I thought that would be the case. Yeah, yeah. I want the two doors in the middle. Yeah, I hope. Uh, the two mirrors in the middle. You can't have them in the middle. Yeah, why can't I? Because the hinges 
go from the edges from there. How can you have them in the middle? Right, turn it upside down. Where are you going to hinge to? That's the same door. Wants to go there. Oh. They just need swapping. You're making my brain do too much work now, aren't you? Plonk. You're making too much work full stop. <laughs> I literally just finished. I did think you would guess that I wanted the two mirrors no, in no. the middle together. Oh, they're a bit weird these, because look, you slow them. Oh, they've got the slow, um, soft close hinge then. Soft oh. close? Yeah. So why is that door lower than the other two it's next Because I've only just put them up. I haven't oh, okay. adjusted anything yet. Right, okay. Yeah, can you swap that one in that one, please? But well done. Do you like them? Well, I did. I'm going. Hello. Oh, right, I'll get on with some more work then. Oh, boy. Shut up. <laughs> oh, let's see if that's how Madam wants them. Oh, extra work. Extra work. Happy? Yeah, brilliant. We were just discussing what we're going to do with the empty corner, weren't we? Well... Shelving you could put in there or a standing unit. Yeah. Let's not worry about it today. No, let's not. No. There's only one problem now. Oh god, now what? White desk. White wardrobes. Yeah. Brown blind. Yeah, that's got to be changed to a white one. <laughs> Brown window. Yeah, needs to be changed to a white one. The whole house needs to change into white windows. That's brilliant. Thank you. Well done. Yeah. That's great. Whatever. <laughs> All to hang your bloody fancy smancy jackets. Uh, no, it's not. Who keeps buying cruise dresses? Me. Yeah, well, I there you go. I needed somewhere for the long ones, didn't I? Uh, you better decide where you want that now, because that's got to be bolted to the wall as well. Yeah. And again, I'm going to have to chop bits of skirting board out. No, you don't have to. Well, yeah, it's got to well, fit flush. Oh. oh, what, to attach it to the wall, you mean? Yeah. Oh, right, okay. Um... Well, I'm wondering if you bring it as far up as you can. He was a genius putting the uh, plug in, by the way. You were. Look at that. Spot on, yeah. So, there you go. so if you leave the same gap, which is about what it is now. Yeah. <laughs> right, let's discuss. Say goodbye. Bye. Bye. Oh, I'll turn <laughs> it around. Hold on. Whoop. Bye.